today I'll be showing you how to check your tire pressure and the importance of it. First step is you need to consult either your owner's manual, that will give you the proper tire pressure, or in your glove box and sometimes in the door jam. There's going to be two numbers, there's going to be a cold and a hot number. If you're checking your tire pressure after your car's set for a while, it's been in a parking lot, let's say, then you use the cold setting. But if you've been driving across town or drove it for a few minutes, then you can use the hot setting. So once you have that either from your owner's manual or a glove box, you're going to come around to your tire, grab your pressure gauge, and you're looking at the PSI, which is pressure per square inch. You're going to put it on your tire, and then the little, it'll pop up. Make sure it's secure on there. So you get a proper reading. You see this one is right around 15 and that's what this tire is supposed to run. And uh, one more thing, if you read here, it'll give you the maximum PSI. You should never um, go higher than the maximum PSI. So if there is a problem with that, you need to consult a mechanic or a tire technician because your reading from your book should be less than the max on the tire.